YSR CP chief has taken his uh, battle against the post poll violence in Andhra Pradesh straight to the national capital. Today he is in Jantar Mantar holding photo and video exhibition. Uh, Jagan Reddy ji, thank you so much for speaking to NDTV. I'll begin by asking you that you had an unusual guest some time back in uh, Akhilesh Yadav, Samajwadi Party chief. Is there some signal of a political realignment? Well, ma'am, the most important aspect here is let's not deviate the issue. See, the topic here is there have been ghastly incidents which have taken place in the state of Andhra Pradesh, which are to be what are to be condemned in a civil society. You know, these kind of acts where Chandra Babu Naidu's own son, Nara Lokesh, actually actually comes up with a red book like this and makes hoardings of these red books. And this photograph is made a hoarding and printed all over the state and literally passes a message that we are going to go ahead, vandalize in the red book as names of all the officers, names of all the politicians on whom vandalism should take place, assault should take place. And this poster, this, these hoardings are published all over the state, giving a message to the police that our people are going on a rampage, you people are supposed to just watch, a rather foister false cases on victims rather than the people who assault. That kind of a message, with that kind of a message, last 45 days in the state is seen these kind of assaults which have never taken place. In fact, all these uh, posters that you see are material evidence and all this video, on these video clippings are all material evidence where you have people literally hacking a person to death. You had written a letter to the Prime Minister that there is some kind of evil design to suppress YSRCP. What has been the response to that? In fact, uh, I had written letters to the Prime Minister, I had written letters to the Home Minister, I had also written letters to the President of the country as well. In fact, we have invited every political party, irrespective of which forum they belong to, asking them to come over and see for themselves these photographs that are displayed, the video clippings that are being played, and make up for themselves, make, up, make their mind for themselves whether this is to be condemned or not. Because if these acts are not condemned, democracy would limp. See, demo, what is democracy? Equitable justice. If equitable justice is not imparted, what happens? This is what you're seeing in, in the state of Andhra Pradesh. And if this is not condemned, then tomorrow they are in power. Tomorrow, tomorrow we will come to power. Yesterday we were in power, but we never did something like this. Today they are in power. They're setting up a new trend printing red books, writing down names, making hoardings of them, I mean, publicizing them as hoardings, and then going ahead with this vandalism. If this kind of things, if these acts are not condemned, then do you think democracy would prevail? One may say that this politics of vengeance which is playing out was also something that we saw during your tenure when there was vindictive action, as Mr. Naidu said, against him and he was sent to jail. Well, never YSRCP or our government indulged in these kind of uh, misdeeds. You know, this is absurd. This is madness. You're talking about more than 1,000 assaults. You're talking about more than 300 attempted deaths. You're talking about across the state more than 30, 30 murders which have, which have taken place across, be it in every category, be it, be it from karikartas to sympathizers to even neutral people. Because law and order is law and order is, is deteriorated. And Mr. Reddy, right now you have another guest here, and again an India partner. How should that be seen? You had written, as you said, to all political parties, but you are getting support from India Block. 
In fact, uh, so we can only request, I can only request Maria to see for herself and protest irrespective of which party it comes from. Have because you got an appointment with the Prime Minister and the Home Minister to is, communicate your concerns? Is to be condemned. I can at best ask them. That's what I did. I humbly asked them and I'm hoping that they would give an appointment and they would also condemn these kind of things. That is the best I can do. But this has got no, there are no parties involved here. Okay. Today is an interesting day because this is coming a day after the budget where 15,000 crore has been announced for uh, uh, financial support for Amravati and also the Pulavaram uh, irrigation project. Uh, how are you looking at these announcements in the budget? No, what, uh, what uh, those announcements would give to the state of Andhra Pradesh is something else. But why Chandra Babu Naidu is doing these kind of things is something else. Chandra Babu Naidu is doing these kind of things because his manifesto promises are heaven and moon which have been promised, knowing very well that they are lies, yet he had promised. And those kind of promises are not going to be met with.